Good morning. We are here at the sanctuary with a big dilemma. I have a horse who's usually out to pasture and he came inside last night because he needed to get his little shoesies done. And so I put him in this stall so the shooter could find him and do it. And I had a stall guard on this stall door because I know it doesn't really work. Once you uh, open it, you can never get it back the other way. And so now this horse who hates being in a stall is stuck in a stall. <sighs> and it's a big problem because he's gonna bang on it all day, which is making it worse. And now the track is totally bent. And I don't know what to do about it. I, I might have to call like a welder. Danny, Danny, what's going on, baby? You got stuck in there? Oh, honey, I'm so sorry, Angel. We'll try and get you out. Oh, look at that face, you guys. He wants to get out so bad. And I can't do anything about it. I can't even get in there. It's so unfair. Oh, honey, I know. Oh, look at the sadness in his eye. Danny. He's frustrated. Okay, I'll work on getting someone out here to rip off this stupid stall door. I know it's stupid, honey. I'm sorry. Also, you guys, Danny here, very handsome young man, perhaps in his late 20s. Danny, this morning he got his hoof stuck in there and I had to jump up and over this gate, which wasn't easy, and get his hoof out. And then I forgot to grab it out of there. Now I have to do it again. But anyways, this little boy would make an excellent child's horse. He was formerly a beach trail riding horse at a trail riding place around here. Okay, let's not get the hoof stuck in there again. Please, please. Okay, I'm gonna have to deal with this right now. Okay, Danny, participate. He's too frustrated. Danny, Danny, no. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Smiling for the camera. Very handsome, baby. You look good. I know you're frustrated, Angel. We'll get you out of here, okay? Look at that face, you guys. Oh, he's so angry right now. Ah, <sighs> poor baby, stuck in a stall. I mean, this is a really nice stall. He does have the ability to go outside and see his friends, but it's really just not good enough. He wants to be full freedom in the pasture and he says this place is bullshit and get me out of here. Do you have like a little claustrophobia? What's going on, baby? Okay, now we can go outside. I think that's a better choice for him. Okay, let's see Max. Max, is that your buddy? Hi, honey. Oh, hiding a little bit camera shy, honey. A little bit. So <laughs> he's just, however I move, he's behind me. So cute. So this charming young fellow would make an excellent child's horse. Um, I wouldn't want anyone over 150 pounds to sit on his back, even though he is in excellent shape. You can see all of those little white spots on his back. Those are saddle sores from ill-fitting tasks. Hi, Max. He needs his morning kisses. Okay, we're back in the stall. <laughs> He's decided there's got to be a way out. He's going to figure it out. What is it, Daniel? What is it, Daniel? It's going to be okay, honey. So, uh, the stupid stall door. Hi. He's very curious. So, sorry, I keep losing my train of thought. He's very distracting. Very cute. He would make an excellent child's horse or... Um, a light adult. He does not do anything but walk. He cannot trot or canter. He's not lame. He just doesn't do it. <laughs> and he deserves not to. So he is walk only. I mean, he runs around in the pasture of his own accord, but he doesn't want to carry anyone at anything more than a walk. And I think that's perfectly fine choice for a horse to make. He's very good on the trail, obviously, as a former excellent trail horse. Oh, honey. 
and uh, he is looking for a home. He would also make a great companion horse to another horse. However, he does tend to get bullied. He's kind of a shy, sweet guy, and um, I would only ask that if he were rehomed as a companion horse, that, that horse is going to be nice to him. Horny, it's going to be okay. He's trying to tell me, come on, get me out of here, get me out of here. Come on, let's go. I know you're frustrated. I'm going to work on it, baby. All right, I'm going to make some calls to see if someone can get us out of this stall.